I am Biterbeck, and welcome to No Man's Sky. Uh, let me show you how to do uh, upgrades for your living ship, uh, just in case you don't know. Uh, some people have gotten their living ships, and, and they don't uh, realize a couple of nifty things about it. Is the living ship the best ship? No, not really. But it has some pretty cool features, and I'll, I'll show you a couple of things here. All right, so without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so I'm at the portal. Uh, and basically, for your living ship, you're going to need some upgrades. And I'm going to show you how to get some upgrades and show you how to upgrade the upgrades. So um, I am in Isingtam right now. And I found this nifty uh, system that has, uh, according to the post on Reddit, and I'll pull that up right here. There it is. Um. And this was made by Lift Heavy, or this was found by Lift Heavy 2003 on uh, Reddit Coordinate Exchange. Um, so this system has three eggs. You have to find the singing eggs. It has three eggs uh, that you get when you pulse. And uh, he actually breaks it down. The first one takes 30 seconds. The second one is 15 seconds. And the third one is 45 seconds. And um, and I'll go through all the steps on how to get it. As well as uh, get you a good look at the coordinates or the, um, the portal address for this site. Um, they're real tiny. I, got, I can't see them. Uh, make them bigger. Okay, now I can see what do I trust? Not you, not Sentinels. Look at this guy landing. Get out of here. Nobody's looking for you. You junk you're selling. Let's activate the portal. And the glyphs are boot. This is a sunset, but I call it a squid. Dragonfly. Galaxy. Why? Jason, Jason Place calls this a flux capacitor. Uh, yeah, it does look like a flux capacitor, but uh, it looks more like a Y. And some people call it a tree. And I call it a Y. They, they have official names, but who cares? Nobody remembers us. They were all long and ridiculous. Uh, waypoint, some people call that a balloon. It looks like a waypoint to me. Uh, dragonfly. Squid again. Bud. <laughs> uh, let's see. Squid. Uh, this is the anomaly. Some people call it a gemstone. I forget what the game calls it. Uh, they call it an anomaly. Uh, and it's one more squid. Squid's not bird. So it's bird, squid, dragonfly, galaxy, Y, waypoint, dragonfly, squid, bird, squid, anomaly, squid. All right. Oh, let me uh, let me get banana Tom. Get out of here, Sentinel. Nobody's looking for you. Let me let me grab my banana Tom. Cause uh, also here's a key key point. Uh, they don't necessarily pop up unless you're in your living ship. And let me make sure I don't have an egg on me. Cargo. Now it won't trigger, hopefully. All right, let's go. Into the void. Fly. Oh, I have to name my ship. That ship is Banana Tom. I need to name him. He hasn't. He doesn't have a name yet. It must be named. I name the Banana Tom. 
Wow, from one pretty planet to another. Ooh, dangerous sentinels. Your uh, oh, you're in the shield. Mm. Hang on, thank you, Sue Lady. What is this? Uh, poor <laughs> jackass. Where, where did my ship go? Oh, but then tell him what are you doing up there? Well, I can see why you'd like this planet. Hey, you come over here, Sentinel. That's gonna be your mistake. Uh, let me let me name this ship right now while I'm thinking about it, because I keep forgetting to name it. What's your name? My name is Banana Tom. Banana Tim. Yeah, banana time. Do 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 banana time. Do 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 do. We all sing for banana time. Do 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 do. I like this planet. I'm gonna put a. You know what? I'm gonna put a base computer right here, just so I can come back to it. Cause it's it's pretty. Base computer, that's not a base computer. There's the base computer, and I'm putting it down. Uh, I will most likely not move this, but I, I probably will. Probably move it over to the water. Uh, take Banana Tom into space. And we're just gonna pulse from here. So this is our fir first pulse, and I think it's supposed to go for 30 seconds. I don't have a timer, so I don't know. I don't know how much time. Not much time. And there is a melody egg, rather. So it should say melody egg when I get closer to it. Or not. Oh, it's a void egg. It changed the name. All right, so there's my first upgrade. It's an A class. And I will change direction. And this one is shorter, 15 seconds. Holy shit. The first time this has ever been accurate. Alright, there's my second upgrade. And let's go towards the space station. Now this one's longer, so I'm actually going to go over the space station. Just in case I get there. Exham... Tau, ex Tau, discovered by Jarl. Nice discovery, dude. That is a sweet ass planet. Banana Tom, do 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 do, banana Tom, do 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 do, do. banana Tom, do 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 do. All right, that's the second verse of the Banana Tom song. So there, now you got your two verses. Leave me alone. And three, three eggs. Wow. And what is that? Neural assembly. Okay. So let's get to the space station. All right. So we got three upgrades. I'm going to get three more and then I'll show you how to upgrade them. Made a save space. Oh, well, while I'm here, let's turn that off. Don't want other people popping in, stealing all my eggs. Um, all right, so did that, did that. Now let's uh, reload our autosave. So basically, it's a rinse and repeat. After you get your three upgrades, you save, and you go back out. Do it again. That this gives three eggs is absolutely freaking amazing. All right, let's go this way. 
So this first pulse is 30 seconds. For those of you that like to keep time on things, I'm not timing this at all. I just go until I get the notification. And if you need to differentiate between a traveling geck salesman and anomaly, I'll show you when it pops up. Okay, anomaly detected. That's a red alert. If it's anything else, it's gray. Okay, if it's anything else, it's gray. When it's red, that is an A or whatever you're looking for in space. Uh, I think, no, freighters come up in gray too when you stumble across one. Okay, let's pulse this way. Fifteen seconds for the second one, and sure enough, it was. Okay, I got a shield. I forgot what I got the first time. And I'm just changing direction, direction, directions. I'm just changing directions. I'm just changing directions, just for the S and Gs. You don't have to, I don't think. Uh, maybe we'll get nine, and I'll, I'll, I'll go in the same direction. So this last one is longer, it's 45 seconds. So what are the benefits? Oh, there, there's, there's the other one. Now that's three. And pulsing heart note, so pulse engine. And, oh, I should have headed back towards the space station. Uh, how am I doing on fuels? Oh, I'm almost down. More gold, feed the beast. Uh-oh. Gonna need some silver. Do I have silver? Yes, I do. Uh, drop that in processor. These hydrox uh, deposits or conglomerations give you 250 silver each. And that is more than enough to power your ship. There. What? Son of a bitch. All right, you asked for it. There's three of them. Oh, it's just one. It's three dots. He did. What do you mean escape possible? Escape is highly probable because he's dead. Goddamn space pirates. Banana Tom. And I'm not singing just about Banana Tom. I'm singing about Banana Tom, my ship. So it's a, it's, it's a, it's a twofer. All right. So let's get in the space station. All right. How many upgrades do I have? And they go right into the ship. So you want to make sure you have, have room. Okay. I have three... Pulsing heart, yeah. Okay, I have three engine upgrades. I have one shield. And I have two. Um, spewing vent. All right, so what's left? You need the laser. Well, the laser, the grafted eyes. The scream suppressor, spewing vent. And the... Uh, Singularity Cortex, that's your hyperdrive. And the time is topped off. I'm gonna go in the same direction towards that blue planet. So, here we go. <laughs> yeah, so to get these, you do have to be in your living ship you get them otherwise they will not show up and it should be about 30 seconds right about now yes ah okay see at the bottom left it says space melody detected okay and we're gonna keep going in the same direction just to see. All right, so this one is faster, 15 seconds. And one more. It's 
And see, a lot of people worry about the class, but I'm going to show you why. You don't need to worry about the class of the upgrade that you get for the living ship. Because you can upgrade that all on your own. And I'll show you how as soon as I get this last bit here. Then I'm going to go back through the portal. Just so I can keep it. I did stop into the space station as well. But um, you don't necessarily have to go back through the portal. And there it is. Third one. So you can get them all going in the same direction as well. Alright, and another spewing vent. Okay. So now I am going to head back to the portal. Back to my base. Um, back to my my base. <laughs> And we'll pick up from there. I will see you in goddamn pirates. How many is it this time? Now I'm going to teach y'all about stopping me while I'm on my progress. Oh, target sighted. Lock. And he go bye-bye. And the same for you. Come back here. There's no getting away. There's no escape. You cannot escape the law. Oops, passed it. Okay, I need that. There we go. All right, where was I headed? Oh, I'm back that away. No, go to go to the base. And ship locking onto uh, ground targets has gotten real wonky. Doesn't want to. Um, all right. So anyway, I'll see you back at my base in just a few moments. In the meantime, here is the coordinates for this system. So those are the co uh, the coordinates, not the coordinates. Those are the uh, glyphs for this system. Just in case you didn't catch it the first two times. <laughs> Here's the third. Here's the third. And see you back at my base in just a few moments. I think this will be the uh, second police station on this planet with all the angry sentinels because why not oh took out that tree well Yeah, that good boy. All right, let's see. So, we have one more singularity. One more of that. Oh, two more spewing vents. Okay, so you'd have to run it a few times to get the ones you need. So these two we don't need at all. So I'm gonna go ahead and take them out and put them in. Oh, you know what? I'll leave them here because I'm gonna upgrade all these. So. How do you upgrade your living ship parts? Well, if you mouse over it or you, know, you know, put the cursor over it, you see it says evolve. And what it does, it takes a certain amount of nanites and it will evolve that to the next level. Now, this is already an A, so let's see what we get. All right, let's see how much it costs. So these are our parts, and to install them, you have to evolve. So I'm going to evolve these three. That turns it into a usable item. Uh, that's spewing vent. So I'm going to put that here. And, of course, the phone rings. And I bet you it's some bullshit. All right, so we involved this for evolved this first part 
And as you see right now, you can evolve it more by, uh, for me, it would be left clicking on it and it'll cost 430 nanites. Let's get all the other parts in here. No, they're not there. They're here. Nah, put that in the organ chamber right there. And you you adjacency bonus just as you would any other upgrade. I keep forgetting to just click back. Okay, so all three of these are A-class. And they're all roughly the same except for this one. This one kind of cheated me. Fire rate, damage, fire rate. And this one cheated. Alright, so let's evolve the technology by left clicking for me. Uh, for you, it's whatever the action button is, I would imagine. So, for 430 nanites, I upgraded this to an S class, and it gives me six more damage, one more fire rate, and one more heat dispersion. Okay, do that again. Okay, you get two more damage on that, and the fire rate and heat dispersion stay the same. And this should actually give me a third component to this. And it did. I got uh, four fire rate and damage. So I upgraded all of these to S class. But yeah, as long as you got the nanites, you can upgrade these to S class super easy. Um, okay, Ugh, did it again? Oh my god! All right, so this one I can go sell, and you could just take it right in and sell it to any of the vendors in the um, what's the thing called a space station? You could you could take this right into any vendor in the space station and sell it for 140 nanites. So it's not bad if you spend uh, like an hour out there gathering bits and bobs, uh, you'll have enough to, to definitely upgrade quite a few pieces in little time. Uh, let's see, what else? What else is there to know? That's it really, that's what you need to know for your living ship. Uh, let's go take a look at these um, Grades and see how they do. Um, you can put in to your ship uh, the Sonata one. Do you could put in all the ship upgrades that you get from um, Quicksilver? So I'm gonna put in the Stealth Starship 12. I don't have Ferrite dust. Seriously, that's insane. Hold on, let's go get some ferrite dust real quick. There we go, got some ferrite dust. And let's go ahead and install that. Yeah! Got that perp. Oh, I guess there's a storm going on. Let's fly around here for a bit. Oh, you son of a bitch. He they, they just whoop right in front of him, man. Stop that. Seriously, Sean, stop it. Oh, okay. So that is just your standard photon cannon for it being in the organ chamber. So let's move them into the standard. Let's make some room. I can put it right here. Here. So it'll change what it shoots. I feel another verse of banana time coming on. Wish you could just move a whole group of these. Once. 
Okay, so now I moved it up front. Let's see what it did. Oh, there it goes. So up front, it turns into the um, combination of uh, photon cannon and cyclotron ballista. And the cyclotron ballista is kind of like a heavy duty infra knife. All right, where are they? Oh, they're over here. Come get some, bitches. Yeah, you better turn around and run away. And it does make short work of everyone. Thanks for trying to help, guy. <laughs> so there it is. There's your living ship in all its glory. Yeah, right now I got 533 hyperdrive range. So as soon as I find some more bits and pieces, I can upgrade that. Um, and you can, just like in your regular ship, put stuff in the standard stores and in tech. Like you see, I moved this over here to give me the cyclotron ballista and I can move it back and it's fine. Um, so that is it. I want to thank you. Thank you very much for watching. Do take care and be well. Do what you like. And most importantly, be safe. Peace.